Are you ready for this one, fight fans? Mike with Fights with Friends, Floyd Mayweather Jr. versus Tension Nasakawa in Japan from the Satana Super Arena, December 31st, Monday, New Year's Eve. I plan on doing a live reaction for this entire card. I don't know where to watch it at yet. Uh, I've been in contact with Fight TV this week, and this is their most recent response. So Thursday, finally, I receive a response from Fight TV. As you can see in my tweet, I tried to contact them several times. I said, hello, do you know if Ryzen 14 will be available in the U.S. yet? Yes or no? Just trying to plan New Year's, and I have been asking repeatedly. Uh, as I have several times and some other people have as well. Uh, Fight TV said, we are awaiting final confirmation. We should know this week. Thank you. Uh, they have had every other Ryzen up to this point, And I bought the last three, 10, 11, 12, well, four, 10, 11, 12, 13. Uh, all four of those I got through Fight TV. Uh, I was hoping they would have 14. Uh, I'm guessing Floyd Mayweather, I'm not sure if that made the pot more expensive as far as to buy the pay-per-view. Another thing some people have mentioned, though, is if this is a boxing match, uh, whether it be an exhibition or not, Showtime uh, has stuck their nose into this, and Showtime has said that they may have some interest in trying to show this on Showtime uh, in the States. Now, I'm not clear if they would try to show the rest of the card, as Showtime does not have any exposure in the MMA world at this time. They have not, except um, since the uh, defunct Elite XC uh, that many of you probably don't even remember way back when they put all their eggs in one basket, that being Kimbo Slice, and he got knocked out by upset uh, by Seth Petrozelli in 14 seconds. Let's take a look at this entire card, though. Uh, there are some other interesting matchups on this. Unfortunately, Mirko Krokop will not be on here as originally scheduled. Vanderlei Silva was also said to originally have been interested in this. Uh, Mirko Krokop came out with a statement saying that Rising could no longer afford him. Uh, because they spent all their money on Floyd Mayweather. Uh, that is listed as the main card. It is listed as a boxing bout, at least on Tapology. Some interesting matchups in here besides this, though. Uh, Kyoji Horiguchi, uh, he will be facing Bellator champion uh, Darian Caldwell. And Ryzen has says this will be for the Ryzen belt. It will not be for the Bellator belt, but it will be for the Ryzen belt. This is a very interesting matchup. Uh, I believe Kyoji Horiguchi is a more overall well-rounded MMA fighter. Uh, he is smaller, though, than Darian Caldwell. On average, uh, they're going to fight... Uh, at that 134 uh, catch weight, though. Darian Caldwell, I believe his wrestling is dominant enough, though, uh, that he will win that match. I think he takes care of uh, Kaoji Huraguchi uh, by unanimous decision. Uh, American Darren Crunkshake uh, taking on Damian Brown. Uh, that's another good matchup. Emmanuel Newton, we have not seen him around in quite some time. Um, he's been training over there in Russia. Uh, Justin Scoggins uh, is in on this one. Uh, so there's a few reputable names. Uh, uh, Yusuke Yachi, a few other names that Americans recognize on here. Uh, of course, the big selling point for this and the thing that's unfortunately going to be a make or break on how we watch this uh, as American fans, is going to be that Floyd Mayweather Jr. versus Tenshin Nasakawa fight. Uh, now, Tenshin Nasakawa, this kid is a stud uh, as a kickboxer. Uh, he is a kickboxer. Supposedly, this is not going to be a kickboxing match. 
Uh, but even Joe Rogan has said this. Don't put it past the Japanese to pull a fast one and say it's in lost in translation uh, that all of a sudden there are now kicks involved. Um, this kid is just 20 years old. Uh, he last fought, though, at 124.7 uh, pounds. So he will have, he will be smaller than Floyd. Uh, he's going to have a weight disadvantage. They may weigh in at the same weight that night, but once they rehydrate and everything, Floyd um, should be quite a bit bigger. Uh, he fought last, I believe, at 147. Uh, so that is a huge difference. Um, same thing, like I said, with uh, Darian Caldwell coming over from Bellator. Kyoji uh, uh, Haraguchi, uh, his last fight uh, was at Bantamweight, 134. But I believe Caldwell's, I could be wrong here. I'm doing this on the fly, but I thought Caldwell... Uh, fought his last fight at a heavier fight, at a heavier weight, excuse me. Yes, he fought at 145. Uh, so 10 pounds difference uh, in theory uh, after hydration and everything. I imagine these guys probably 10 pounds difference. I think that'll be enough uh, for Darian Caldwell to take that though. But this is champion versus champion. Uh, you also have an atom weight a world championship going on between uh, Kana Asakura uh, versus Ayaka uh, Hamasaki. That is the co-main event. Both of these ladies are very popular in Japan, uh, so they will get a ton of support. Darren Crunkshake, uh, now this at least his third fight uh, in Ryzen, maybe more. Uh, third that I can remember uh, in Ryzen. Uh, he's been doing pretty good over here or over there. Uh, what do you guys think? What uh, is it worth putting Floyd Mayweather Jr. in this card? Uh, also, are you interested in seeing it? Are you interested in seeing the entire Rising card? Are you interested to see what happens between Floyd Mayweather Jr. and Tenshin, Tenshin Nasakawa, a much younger, much faster, but much less experienced fighter? Uh, I want to know what you guys think. I plan on figuring out some way uh, to do this. Time. Uh, it will be at 9 p.m. Pacific in the States. Uh, Monday, it will start at midnight Eastern Time, New Year's Eve. So we'll be ringing in the New Year literally uh, with this right here so i would start a stream uh a little early uh that way we could ring in new year's together uh have a drink together on eastern time uh and then i'll have a drink with you for every time zone uh we'll break it into pacific uh but these are very long events uh they generally last like six seven hours with an intermission in there so uh, don't expect me to be drinking a ton right at the beginning uh, of the event. Um, but what what do you guys think about this? I want to know if you guys think it, Floyd Mayweather, could he lose? Uh, what do you guys think about the other fights on here? Uh, do you think this goes to Showtime? Do you think it goes to Fight TV? Uh, do you think somehow it lands on zone who I've also reached out to? Uh, they have not gotten back to me yet. Let me know what you think down there in the comments. Please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and ring that bell if you're new here to be notified whenever I drop a new video uh, or start a new live stream. Until later, as always, I love you, I respect you, and I'll see your finances later.